back to school, back to school, to prove to dad that I'm not a fool. I got my lunch packed up, my boots tied tight. I hope I don't get in a fight. Oh, back to school, back to school, back to school. Well, here goes nothing. So here we go again, another tech show. This is NAC TV. Connection is guaranteed. I'm free for the masses. So let's get down to business. I'm static. I'll be the host on this crazy connected show. Don't lose me the further I go. Getting lost in the mix. Technology moving quick. The purpose for all of this is to show you that you can live with it. It's easy. Go tell a friend. Yeah. Let's go. What's up YouTube? That's right, back to school. A time of year where you're probably going to be taking massive amounts of notes for information that you're probably not even going to use. Luckily, I got just the thing to help out with that note taking fight. This is the Adonit Jot Touch, a Bluetooth enabled stylus that's really light. You do need Bluetooth 4.0 or maybe a newer iPad for this to work. And let's face it, it will work with only iOS. Me personally, I like the thickness of the Jot Touch. It might be because I'm used to holding thicker pens. I don't know. It does come with a USB magnetic base. And the crazy thing about this base is that the, that the magnetic that's holding the stylus is not something that you could just tip over with the slightest of touch. It stands strong. And the Jot Touch does have a standby time, it's about a month, which is ridiculously insane if you ask me. <laughs> With heavier use, I was able to squeeze out about 11 hours of juice out of the Jot Touch. Zero to 90 to get a full charge. That's the only drawback to this device. In previous models, they had a replaceable battery if you ran out. If you run out of juice now, you're stuck having to recharge and wait until it's done charging to be able to use it. Where is it now? There's still some overlap between the needle and the slash below the E. How low are you gonna go? Oh, I've been in the slash many times. This is nothing. You'll get used to it. Just put it out of your mind. The Jot Touch does come with a tip that's three millimeters wide and 2,048 levels of pressure. What that means is that whatever way you write or draw on a surface is going to adapt to be as natural as it can be to match who you are. The A and B buttons can be programmed to act as shortcuts for redo or undo. Back on the tip of the jot, it will not scratch the screen. And that's if you're using a screen protector or not. Totally up to you. The Jot has a hell of a feature built into it to work with your iPad called Palm Rejection. When this feature is turned on, it lets your screen know if your palm or your pen is touching to alleviate any extra marks on the screen, which is very helpful. Suspect, miss, palms on the glass. Move those hands, I'll slap the taste out of your mouth. You understand me? Put your face right up against the glass, right there. The Adonit Jot Touch does come in black or white for $99 ideal for anybody going back to school. Well, that's it for now. Hope you enjoyed. I'm Static and this is Inact TV. You can follow me on Twitter at Inact TV with two T's and follow me on Facebook. That's Inact TV with three T's. Also, go ahead and follow me on Instagram as well. That's gonna be N underscore A-C-T-T -T underscore TV. Go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe. Peace. The Adonis Jot Touch does come with the Adonis Jot. The Adonis Jot Touch does come in black or white for nice screen. It lets your screen know if your palm or your pen or the pen is touching to alleviate any extra uh, marks on your screen. When this feature is turned on your screen. It lets the screen, when this feature is turned on, 
unless your screen knows if your palm or your pen is touching.